We'll uh, start with some questions here for you. Just uh, tell us how things are going here in spring practice. Has it been a whirlwind for you since you since you got here? Uh, it's been really good. Um, just getting here in, I guess, January. Um, it was important to, you know, get down the new playbook and everything for spring ball. Um, I feel like there's probably still ways to go with that, but um, I feel like I've made some really good progress with that. Hey, Charlie, uh, Coach Freeze brought this up Monday of how you've brought in and elevated the competition level among the quarterbacks in that room. And was that something you envisioned doing when you elected to come to Liberty, was help raise the level of competition? Yeah, I mean, I think that competition is great. Um, and it's really, no matter what school you go to across the country, there's going to be a lot of competition at, at each position. So, um, yeah, I mean, I feel like I just embrace competition. Um, want to help out the other guys, too. Um, and just, you know, make it fun. Hey, Charlie, you've played a lot of football at a high level. How much have you used that experience to, uh, you know, kind of help the other guys? you got a lot of young guys in that quarterback room. How have you used that to, to kind of help them and, and help coach them along this spring? Yeah, I think that all of us help each other. Um, I mean, if anyone ever has a question, you know, I'll give them my thoughts on it or whatnot. Um, but I think that everyone does a good job of helping each other out and uh, kind of just helping each other. Charlie, Coach Freeze told a story uh, back on signing day when your name was uh, one of the ones on the list that he met with you and your parents or your family, I guess, at, a, at an airport hangar. And yeah. And kind of went over the, uh, the offense and everything. Take me back to that meeting. What what sold you on Liberty being a, a good fit? What what was your impression of the offense in that presentation? Yeah, I mean, I think that I fit the offense pretty well, play fast. Um, I feel like that's kind of when I've been at my best throughout my career is uh, playing fast and obviously all the different RPOs in this offense. And, you know, really what intrigued me too was just – Coach Freeze's track record with quarterbacks. I mean, you know, I know some of those guys, and uh, you know, there's just been a lot of success with him, with the, kind of with quarterbacks. Hey, Charlie, did you get a chance to catch up with Matt Rule uh, the, the last uh, week during pro day, and uh, what was that conversation like? I did. Yeah, uh, Coach Rule is awesome. You know, obviously, I was with him for like three years, um, so it was really good to see him and. Chat it up for a little bit. And one another one. Uh, your brother played in this neck of the woods over at Virginia Tech. Um, did you get a chance to go to any of the games there at Lane Stadium? And did that maybe play a factor into coming to Liberty because you sort of were familiar with this this part of the country? Yeah, so, yeah, so the first question, I did go to, like, one or two games. Um so yeah, I've been up to that's I forget what their stadium's called, but up to Blacksburg, been to been to one of their games up there, and uh, I mean he definitely told me that Virginia is awesome. Um, I don't know if it played like a huge part, but I mean definitely the input was nice to have. Yeah. Charlie, when you watch this offense on tape, and you know all the great things Malik Willis has done over the last couple of years. How do you envision yourself being in there? You talked about playing up tempo RPOs. Is it easy to see yourself in there having success? And uh, can we expect you to pull off some of the runs that Malik did? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I can run, but I'm definitely not as fast as Malik, so don't hold me to that. Um, but no, I feel like um, you know I can get the ball out of my hands quick, um, which is a lot. A lot of what's asked in this offense is you know to get the ball out and be accurate. And, uh, you know, I kind of feel like I can do those two things pretty well. Coach Freeze uh, speaks very highly of uh, QB coach Ken Austin. Uh, what, what has your interaction been like with him over the past couple months? Yeah, it's been great, Coach Austin. Um, he's a great coach. Definitely taught me new stuff about, um, you know, just quarterbacking, offense, you know. Um, it's been good. He, he kind of has a different way of coaching it, so it's been cool to come in and learn that and, it's been great. What are some of those differences you've seen from other quarterback coaches you've had? 
Yeah, I mean, just how kind of pre-snap you would read a defense or, you know, how you want to attack them. Some guys just kind of do it a little bit differently. Stuff like that. Uh, Charlie, wanted to ask you about uh, your decision to transfer from Utah after four games. What went through that process of wanting to use your final year of eligibility elsewhere? Yeah, I mean, I think that it, uh, you know, kind of, I don't think I fit there very well. I, I don't think I fit well in the offense. Kind of wanted to get to something more like uh, this. Um, so, you know, I feel more comfortable in this type of an offense. So, you know, Liberty is, you know, perfect. Was it a blessing in disguise that you had that COVID year uh, yes. as an option? Yeah, COVID year and I never redshirted. So that's kind of what saved me. <laughs>